All right. They just got in confirmation. Yep. <laughs> had a little, had a little burp. Oh, I just got so many notifications. Oh, that one was for me. Yeah, I saw that. I'm gonna check that in a second. All right, so where did they go? Oh, they're starting with Smash Bros. Yeah, just go back to where they originally played. Okay, let's see how this goes. Bronze Adam versus Haran. Anna, right? Let's see. I think those arrows do make a lot of sense. Does Lucina has to cut through them or she has to duck through them? I say what gives like the edge for both these characters is walking, but Lucina's walking is just so much better. Oh my god, yeah, she has I'm pretty sure she's tied with she is tied with Mark, but well, let's say let's say they're basically like one character, just like two different mechanics. Yeah. So she has the fastest walk speed in the game. Like, she can, Shulk with speed art has the fastest walk in the game. I oh, believe. he'll he'll be he'll be tied he'll yeah. be tied with Mark and Lucina. Yeah, I believe the fastest walkers in the game are Shulk's with speed art, Lucina, tied with Marth. There's one other person I can't remember. Oh, well, alright, like nice down smash coming from Bronze. I'm getting the second hit. Very like, good. Yeah. Oh, tries to go for an air dodge. Yeah. Oh. I don't really understand that uh, that forward smash from Bronze because Lucina didn't have a reason to go to the ledge. That made a lot of sense, yeah. Well, like, maybe if he were caught, maybe if he caught Bronze sleeping. Yeah. Oh, did he snatch the jump? No, oh, no. Mark and Lucina fair. have very good vertical height in their recovery. Yeah, very, very smart. Oh! That, if, he Ooh, had a okay. chance, if he had a chance to S smash or down smash, that yeah, would I totally thought chance. he was going to forward smash him. Good roll. Oh, he got the roll. Good mash. Oh, that jump away. A, that was a really good mash. I believe he still has jump. Forces him to early up be a good idea. And this is just a fight of the neutral right now. Free dash attack. Now, yes. this, now this is the scary part. Lucina's, oh, Lucina's okay. strong. Yeah, Lucina can actually kill with a gimp. Right I now. say that she can kill right now with a forward smash at the ledge. Yeah. But Agreed. If she gets a if she gets a nair set up. Oh. Honestly, a ledge back air will kill. Gonna get the He tries Oh, he went for the fake trump. I say if Bronze calls out a laggy a laggy Ooh. button, he can just side beat. Uh, yeah, I agree. But side beat. This is really scary for Lucina. Yeah. Oh, and the down reverse down smash. This really is, uh, yeah, observing this matchup, this is a very, uh, very strange knockout oh. matchup. Because Lucina can't get. I forgot if Lucina's Okay. Oh, nice hurly up. Yeah. Ah, oh, okay. I, okay, there we go. <laughs> cool. Good, you get to stay with me. Oh! Ooh, almost got the shield. Just break. charges it, but just almost breaks it. And, ooh, there it is, yep. Nair won the forward smash. Looking like Roy. Yeah. Here we go. This is completely possible. Oh, Phantom Footstool. Yeah. With one Gimp, this is... Ooh. If he stalled the upbeat, he would have caught Celeste. So it's good that Lucina's going off stage and challenging Pick. It's like, hits recovery is free. I agree. No hit, hitbox, you're sitting... You're, si you're sitting duck. Oh, my God. Lucina having consistent damage on that entire sword. Exactly. All these hits are really stacking up. Pit can kill with an upbeat, but Lucina can kill with a neutral air forward smash, I believe. Oh no, I've, I've seen that a side B will kill. I mean, pretty much anything, like, any one, smash attack. One read will kill. Oh, yeah. Smash will. Hey, right, you want me to go play now? Right. Ben, you want to hop on commentary? Okay. <laughs> Fume has to go play his match, and I'm lonely. All right, joining me on the mic is T-Man here. Hi, how you doing? Doing all right. All right. All right, now we have uh, Bronze versus, uh, well, he goes by Entel, but I think he's using a different tag today. Like Heron or something like that. Um, yeah. I say Charizard? Hmm. This will be a tricky matchup. Charizard being really heavy. Yeah. And Pit, and Pit like, kills really late as it is. Yeah, true. Especially on this stage. Um, like, I know Haran, he'll be fine with taking all the hits. That's just giving him more rage. Exactly. And Pit, not exactly being a heavy character, he's actually light. Yeah, Pit, the only rage that Pit gets is on his, like, uh, his side B. And his side B isn't really that easy to land if you're if you like keep your distance rather like there's like it has a slow startup so like you can you yeah can exactly but as for charizard he if he oh yeah he Char can challenge his side b with his but his will win 
Oh, yeah. oh, forward smash. Nice. That forward Charizard being so strong, that forward smash also being invincible as well. Charizard is scary. No, Charizard's under, I say Charizard's under raid. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I, li I like the, that side B, getting back to stage. I know with that Flare, using Flare Blitz to recover, yes, risk because you take damage as well, but you're giving yourself more rage. Ooh. Forward smash, almost takes a battlefield, saving him. Oh, gets sniped. Ooh, has to watch out for the arrows, though. Uh, I, I think he's fine taking these hits. Like. I've been... There's oh. been multiple times where I've been uh, right, hit Haran. by one of those arrows by the blast zone, and I've died for it Haran. too many, too many times. Haran has to be smart with his ledge getups. Nice, yeah. Like hits, hits, up smashes extremely fast. Oh yeah. Oh no, no, this is the scary part. Like a rage back here from Charizard. Like if he catches him at the ledge, like that back here can kill extremely early. Oh my Ooh. god. Oh. Yeah. Nice challenge, nice challenging his forward air with his forward air. Yeah, I don't know. Does Charizard have any good like get up options on the ledge? Oh, uh, not, really? nece not necessarily. Like, he can struggle to get off at the ledge at times. Yeah, so he's definitely gonna like right here. He's gonna be watching out for pit. Oh, but he can do that. Oh, nice. All right, that's it. Oh, that's good. Forward tilt. Oh, that up smash is not being that good. He tried to bronze him. Try to do it to himself. So that, that's what bronze does. Tries to look for an up smash by the ledge. Because if he jumps from the ledge, he can catch him with the up smash. Oh, another Ooh. forward smash coming up from Haran. Like, he takes it two and two for forward time. Let's go, Haran. Yeah, no, Haran is actually a personal friend of mine, so I play with him all the time. Um, yeah, he's he's doing a very fundamental base, sort of like Bronze as well. Um, but yeah, he's just an overall solid player. He doesn't get out as that much, though. So he's starting to come out more? Yeah, I, ho I hope so. That'd be good to come out more like Smash Ultimate's coming out in December. I say try out in this game as much as you can. True, true. Um, he could also go, like, I hope he comes to Shine. I'm going to Shine. You're going to Shine 2018? Yes, I am. That's like the first major I've ever been to, and it'll probably be the last major for Smash 4. The serious, serious See, one, anyways. I thought CEO was going to be the last one. Last major for Smash 4? Yes, because CEO 2018 is happening. Like, not long after Hyrule Saga. Yeah, isn't Shine after that, though? I believe so. Anyways. Oh, he's switching off to Falco. I say. Oh, okay. Interesting. Ooh, I say that this will be a. This is going to be an interesting matchup. Falco having one of the fastest air speeds in the game. Like he can combo. He can combo uh, dark pick extremely hard. Oh yeah. And having a frame four back air. Like. Ooh. I say Falco. Ha oh. oh. Now that's now that's. Yeah, the, bronze. That's the suck. That's the sucky part right there. It says Falco's LB being a multi hit. Just trade with it, and like he'll just sink on the rock. Bronze rarely misses those. You have to get like the middle of the of the down air too. The thing about that spike, the spike, it, yeah. It's active for one frame and it's placed in the middle. <laughs> nice. So he was gonna get that or get the sour hit. Yeah. Um. I say Falco, Falco's like good at stuffing approach options either with jab or down tilt. Down tilt being so fast. Heron oh. Heron plays a lot of characters. Um. But yeah, he, I guess he thought Falco was good against is good against Pit for this matchup. Um, I say it would be good if he's not careful off stage. It's probably because of Smashville. Smashville. Um, Falco has like a strong back air, so. Yeah, so he has one of the fastest back airs in the game. But at the same time, like Dark Pit, like kills off the side mostly. So it's like I don't know. He can kill off the side, kill off the top. And, like he's a yeah, he kills character. off the top too. But like his forward throw is like had a lot of knockback. He can kill off Electroshock. Oh, forward smash. Oh, yeah, bronze. forward smash. Yeah. I like I like this. I like that layout. The thing about Dark Pit is like he's called Jank Pit because given his name because side beat. 